Hey, what's up everyone? Sorry about the noise going on behind me. I am running the CNC. It's not too loud. The vacuum is pretty much just as loud as the CNC. So far, I've done about six different projects. It's a little bit of a learning curve. Um, I've done a toolbox, maybe four doors, uh, two signs. I made a catch-all tray. Good learning experience. The program is really fun to work with. Let me show you a few of my projects. I'll go over some of the cut settings that I use to help you if you're in the same boat here. But let me show you around a bit. A couple projects I made. This one is for the bits. This one right here is for the clamps and other things. Made this real quick. This is how it's set up. Got the probe going down to this controller. And that controller goes to the computer. And it also goes to this computer. Got my auto on off switch for the vacuum table here. All right, with the dust boot removed, we're going to go ahead and uh, probe it. This machine comes with a probe over the material. Right. Then we're going to attach this clip. Clip is attached. Go ahead and touch there, and it's ready to be probed. I reattach the dust chute. All right, that's good. Okay, dust chute is attached and we're ready to carve. Here are the uh, shaker doors that we made. It took about two or three mess ups before we got all these right. We're finishing up the shaker style doors. I used all these bits that come in the shaker door bit set on Inventables website. If I measure correctly, 